KKL News 8's Weather on the 8s with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning. It is 638 on this Monday. Let's take a live look at the Harrisburg sky cam. You can see not the sun out there. It's bright as the sun, though. That is the full worm moon this morning and it's setting. So if you want to take a look for yourself, this picture does it no justice. Just look out to the west. You can't miss it out there. Now the full moon uh, does become full officially at 1:48 p.m. when it's below the horizon today. But moonset this morning is at 745. Moon rise this evening is at 713 and both viewing conditions will be very good. Just a few high clouds out there. Here's our News 8 Storm Team forecast today. Bright sunny skies and boy is it going to be toasty. How about a high of 70? Warmest day of the week, over 20 degrees above average today. Now it will be a little breezy this afternoon. That's going to mix down the warmer air. Winds die down tonight, 46 to 50 overnight and becoming cloudy. So a little change in the game here for tomorrow. We'll see some scattered showers returning. I think there'll be a few around in the morning, more in the afternoon and evening, and the showers will be on again off again throughout the day. But even with showers, temperatures stay mild in the 60s. Here's your currents 32 in Sealands Grove, 36 in Harrisburg, 37 Carlisle. We have 28 in York where it's clear and calm. So in spots that typically get colder than your surrounding areas, that's where you're going to find some 20s this morning. But that's just a shallow layer of cold air right at the surface. Current sustained wind speeds fairly calm. They'll be picking up to 15 miles per hour this afternoon, though, and that is going to bring the warm air in. So we're looking for warmest day of the week with the highs near 70, full sunny skies, high pressure and control. Next weather system is out there on the left hand side of your screen and that comes in tomorrow with some rain. So let me show you with the predictor high pressure. Big Blue H moves out to sea as we head into the afternoon. That gives us that southerly flow today, southerly southwesterly. Tonight clouds thicken up. You'll see them here on the screen for tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. And then we'll see some scattered showers late morning again in the afternoon and evening with this cold front that passes. Cold front comes through. I think we'll see a little sun on Wednesday. But a disturbance will increase our clouds by afternoon and there might be a stray shower late on Wednesday. Predictor estimated rainfall totals. This is for tomorrow. Show a few tenths of an inch of rain around the area. Not a lot. I mean, every time it seems to rain around here, it just rains lightly. We really haven't had any kind of concern for flooding or very heavy rain lately or all winter long. In fact, there's a seven day forecast. Temperatures remain spring like all the way through. Coldest day is Sunday at 46. Kind of seems chilly after today's 70, doesn't it? It does. <laughs> yeah, but it's pretty close to average. Just a couple degrees lower. So. Exactly. Yeah. Average for this time of the year. It's 48. Right. Right. <laughs>